this uh, summit to welcome you. Uh, we need to thank you uh, for taking time out of your uh, weekend uh, to be here uh, today uh, to uh, gather, uh, to connect with each other, and to think about um, our community and how we move forward uh, together, uh, some of the issues that are here. So uh, I just want to really thank you for that. Uh, the program has been designed so that it has opportunities for lots of networking, right? Uh, opportunities for you to get together and know each other, and then also think about um, what are some of the issues that are important. And so we try to uh, bring that out in different ways, and um, we want to share that and let, let people know about that. Uh, before I begin, uh, can I just, uh, just appreciate the folks that work with us on this summit. Uh, first of all, it's the conveners. Uh, Richard Kanda, where are you? Richard Kanda. For Aki. We were looking for something to do together for a long time. And uh, when we thought of the I summit in Silicon Valley over 20 years ago. So it's been a long time. And so we want to see um, how it might go across. And so, um, so we're doing this. Uh, we're already thinking about next year and the year after the next. And so what we're going to rely on you to do is to participate, is to think, and to observe. And then give us some feedback. Like, how can this be really useful right, when we gather like this and when we gather again next year? The idea is how do we understand each other more? How can we gather our collective strength to leverage it to do something that really uh, advances us as, uh, in, in our community in, in, in this uh, country? So uh, please do that. Um, so the, the, the conveners is besides the Pali, Asia Pacific American Leadership Institute, Asian Law Alliance, ACI, uh, each of our staff um, really complemented each other to put this on. And if you have suggestions, uh, please uh, let us know. Um, I want to thank our sponsors and our partners. Uh, um, I also want to thank Civic Leadership USA. Anthony Ng is the Executive Director. So they are actually not only conveners, but they actually are our main sponsors. So we really want to recognize them and thank them for all the work that they do uh, nationally in uh, engaging and really um, uh, encouraging civic leadership uh, on a national level. Thank you so much. Uh, we want to thank our host uh, convener, um, Marianne Dewan, Superintendent, Dr. <laughs> work uh, with us on this. Uh, we also want to thank our sponsor, uh, Kaiser Permanente. I know that Han Mo is here. Han, are you here? Han? Yeah, here. Han is here. And then, uh, and then our media partners, uh, Ding Ding TV, Indica, and then our community partners. Uh, we have over 20 community partners um, that uh, we sort of let the word out. We want to be very inclusive, and so uh, we want to thank them for uh, coming here, being part of this, and then sending the word out. Uh, we're hoping that uh, this, w w we're meeting in such a way that we could really leverage this. And if you know of other uh, groups that want to be uh, community partners uh, with us, uh, please invite them uh, next year. Um, so uh, looking at the uh, attendance for today, at first we really didn't know what to expect here, the truth, right? So we uh, wanted to be deliberate in what we do, that's what we know. We want to uh, use this event to help build community. We want to use this event to give voice um, um, in different ways, different groups, different uh, socioeconomic backgrounds, different generations. And so I think the folks that are here, we actually uh, promoted it uh, through our different organizations. But at least, but then we also, uh, how, how can I say this properly? Uh, we also did try to just get our relatives to come. That's <laughs> <laughs> we wanted the right people 
to come, right? And so in this room, the people that are in here, there are lots of people that are in the uh, community-based organizations, the leaders and the staffs of community-based organizations. I think about over 50 of them are community-based organizations. Uh, we have a lot of um, folks that self-identify as activists that, that try to do good in our community. So we have a lot of those folks uh, here. Uh, we have students. We have over 30 students uh, with us here, and they present a very important voice for us. And so we're just very grateful that they uh, could be here. And last but not least, we have uh, a number of uh, elected officials here. Uh, we have uh, over 20 elected officials that have come to participate uh, in this event. So uh, one of the things that we did in trying to see what's on people's minds was to ask you, if you remember when you registered, you actually put in a word. Like if you have to choose one issue related to the Asian American community, what word uh, would you choose? And uh, predictably, uh, we got all kinds of responses, lots of responses. But we do have it summarized a little bit in a word cloud. And the word cloud is all over the place. It's not on your program. But Anthony, do you, can you, this question, uh, can you, can you bring up the word cloud? Uh, he's going to be fancy. You could do it from there. All right. So, uh, <laughs> so anyway, so you can see what's on the word cloud. And, they are on the boards everywhere. Um, and what the word cloud does so interestingly and nicely, it just takes in that data and it transfers it into a visual. So the, 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 the bigger it is, the more people say that. that makes sense. So you can see representation, lots of people uh, are into saying that that's a huge issue in our community. Uh, mental health, immigration, community awareness, census, identity, participation, uh, disaggregating data and so so you can see many things but it gives you a little bit of a sense what what as leaders here our community leaders are thinking thinking that it's important so that's one thing we did another thing we did is that uh, before this gathering we gathered our students together and we gathered our public officials together and asked them the same questions well, what what are some uh, important issues that you think are out there uh, relating to the Asian American community. So I'm going to bring them out, and I'm trying to decide, should I bring up the officials first? Yeah, we should be nice to the older people. <laughs>